Welcome back and thanks for staying with us. Thousands of demonstrators are marching through Hong Kong to protest against a proposed extradition law which could allow the Chinese authorities to target political enemies in the territory. Opposition activists say sending suspected lawbreakers to the mainland to face trial would threaten the territory's judicial independence. The law's supporters have accused the opponents of politicizing the proposal. The former British colony of Hong Kong returned to Chinese rule in 1990 with a guarantee of its freedoms, including an independent judiciary under a one-country, two-systems formula. In Botswana, where the country's former president, Ian Khama, continues to lash out at his successor, Mohwezi Masisi. Khama calls Masisi an autocratic who's failing his citizens. Meanwhile, Masisi is appealing for space to do his job. Masisi returned from his trip to the U.S. Among others, he addressed the question of the country's decision to leave the ban on wildlife hunting. That ban was put in place by Kama, a decision that seems not to have gone down well with the past administration. There are concerns that Masisi is undoing past government policies. In an interview with the SABC last week, Kama said what his father built is now breaking up. For me, Yes, if you want to say I've betrayed the BDP, fine. But at least I am clear in my own mind, I have not betrayed the country. And I'm doing this for the country. In the past, Khama accused Masisi of purging his people. Addressing the media, Masisi spoke less of the confrontation and chose to say the government will speak for itself. Let me do what you asked me to do. If you're tired of it, you will decide at the, at the elections. Uh, you have a choice. Meanwhile, Masisi took a swipe to some animal lobby rights groups regarding reports of Botswana and banning elephant hunting. We have never at any time suggested we wanted to exterminate elephants. And it's quite ironic because it is we who are one of the driest countries in Southern Africa who have homed the largest elephant population in the wild in the world. Masisi says Botswana has set aside 42% of the land for the protection of the environment. When I was there, I then discovered that they are actually culling 